Both Shortwood and Tottenham went into this Valentine's Day clash level on points, but there was no love shown towards the home side early on. With just 13 minutes on the clock, a floated ball from the left was met by Marley Thomas. His first touch was excellent, his second, clinical. 1-0 Shortwood, Thomas is sixth of the season. Things went from bad to worse for Totten, as just two minutes from the interval, defender Jamie Blackburn provided Shortwood with a Valentine's Day gift of his own. His attempted back pass was cut out. Shortwood's Lewis Summers went one-on-one -on -one with the keeper and made no mistake. An emphatic finish. Summers tenth of the season, ensuring the visitors entered the break two goals up. The second half saw improvement from Totten, but they simply failed to make their opportunities count. Steve Riley talked of his disappointment at his team's overall performance. I think we gifted them both goals. Uh, I thought we were the only team likely to score second half. Had a lot of possession today, had some good performances today, so yeah, we're a bit disappointed as a, as a group. Final third, I think we lacked that quality cross or pass or you know, anything just to get a goal. I thought we lacked that in the, in the final third. Um, always there's loads, loads of games left, you know, I think uh, the next four games are going to be tough. Uh, see, see where we are after the four games and I think that might define us as a, as a club and where we are really. Following Saturday, Totten's winless streak now extends to three games. And with a difficult fixture against second place Taunton up next, Totten need a reaction to keep their playoff hopes alive. Isaac Edwards, Winchester News Online.